हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू स्पेक्ट्रम क्लासेस दिस इज आर अनदर लैब एक्टिविटी वीडियो एंड इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू परफॉर्म एन एक्सपेरिमेंट द एम ऑफ द एक्सपेरिमेंट इज डिटर्मिनेशन ऑफ एसिड वैल्यू ऑफ एन ऑयल एंड इन माय प्रीवियस वीडियो आई हैव ऑलरेडी परफॉर्म एन एक्सपेरिमेंट इन विच वी हैव डन द सपोनिफिकेशन वैल्यू ऑफ एन ऑयल सैंपल so here in this video first we are going to discuss what is the difference between the acid value and the saponification value how these are going to be reported and how we are going to perform this experiment so let's start with the theory what is called acid value so the acid value as the name suggests is the number of milligrams of potassium hydroxide the molecular formula of potassium hydroxide is koh we can also use naoh right required to neutralize the free fatty acid which is present in 1 gram of the fat so this is called acid value therefore the acidity is an expression of the content milligram per gram of koh of free fatty acid present in the fat or oil sample so here this free word is very very important free fatty acids so in previous video in the saponification value there we are going to calculate total fatty acids which are present in a oil or fat sample and here in acid value we are going to measure the free fatty acid content the percentage of free fatty acids can be expressed on the scale of lauric acid palmitic acid or oleic acid as mentioned in the table for different kind of oil conventionally the acidity is always expressed with respect to oleic acid if it is not further specified so here the nature of fat expressed as these molecular weights since we do not know the molecular weight of the pre fatty acids present in the oil and fat sample so they are measured on the scale of with respect to following acids now the requirements requirements are as we have discussed in our previous experiment so conical flask pipette burette and beaker and in chemicals we require fat or oil sample ethanol phenolphthalein and 0.1 normal koh solution here preparation of 0.1 normal koh solution and its standardization is given in the experiment determination of saponification value of an oil sample if you need to prepare this solution you can go and check that experiment and how the ethanolic solution of 1 gram coconut oil is to be prepared that i am going to show you here coconut oil so here i am going to weigh this is 1.03 grams and i will make ethanolic solution of this coconut oil so 25 ml of this ethanol is added to the conical flask this petri dish i am again going to weigh so we will subtract the mass so it is 1.01 gram i am adding the ethanol to this fat and now we are going to heat this for 5 minutes here after heating it looks like this So, if we are talking in context with the edible oil, in the edible oils, the acid constituents are formed due to oxidation of oil components by enzymes or the oxygen present in the air or moisture, and that causes an unpleasant smell, which is also known as rancidity. So, here I am showing you this with the help of this equation. So, this is what this is triglyceride. and with the help of this enzyme or acid or in the presence of moisture they will convert it into free fatty acids as well as glycerols so just because of these free fatty acids we will have very unpleasant smell in the food items and this is also termed as rancidity if we are talking in context with the lubricating oils then this free fatty acids are formed either by the addition of additives or by the formation of so2 during the improper processing of oils or by the combustion of fuels so there are several reasons through which these free fatty acids are present in the lubricating oil 
सो हाउ वी आर गोइंग टू मेजर दिस फ्री फैटी एसिड विच आर प्रेजेंट इन दैट और ऑयल सैंपल सीन्स दिस इज एसिड एंड इफ वी टाइटेट इट विद द हेल्प ऑफ ए बेस दैट इज के ओ एच और एनी ओ एच देन वी विल गेट द सोडियम सॉल्ट ऑफ दिस एंड एसिड प्लस बेस विल गिव द सॉल्ट एंड दैट रिएक्शन इज नोन एज न्यूट्रलाइजेशन रिएक्शन हेयर आई शो यू द प्रोसीजर वी ऑलरेडी वे वन ग्राम ऑफ फैट एंड वी डिज ऑलरेडी ट्वेंटी फाइव एम एल ऑफ इथेनॉल सोल्यूशन वी आर एडिंग नाउ फिनोक्सलीन टू दिस एंड वी आर गोइंग टू टाइटेट इट विद रेस्पेक्ट टू जीरो पॉइंट वन मोलर एन यू एच सोल्यूशन एट द एंड पॉइंट पिंक कलर विल अपियर एंड वी विल रीड द रीडिंग्स देयर now to this fat solution we are going to add phenoxylene indicator now we shake no color is appear in the acidic medium and we are going to titrate it with 0.1 molar koh solution you see slight pink color is going to be appear here is the reading 27.5 so initially it was 27 and now it is 27.5 now the observation table for ethanol only we have performed this titration since ethanol is used as a solvent that is termed as blank since it is not having any fat content so for blank solution it is 0.1 and for fat solution it is 27 initial and 27.5 final reading so after subtracting we get 0.5 ml for test solution now the calculations formula to calculate the acid value is volume consumed against the fat solution into normality of koh into molecular weight of koh divided by weight of fat which is 1.01 gram here so volume is test minus blank so that is 0.4 into normality is 0.07 into 56.1 gram is the molecular weight of koh divided by fat of 1 gram we get 1.57 mg koh for 1 gram so this is the unit how we are report this acid value as well as saponification value now the results if this is the acid value and if we want to calculate the free fatty acids that is calculated in percents so this free fatty acid is reported with respect to this acid value divided by 2 this free fatty acid is reported in context to oleic acid it is equal to acid value divided by 2 and if we are putting this acid value as 1.57 divided by 2 then we get a, free fatty acid percent is equal to 0.785 so this is how one can calculate for free fatty acids students get confused between the acid value as well as free fatty acid formula so here we are having volume of koh consumed against the fat into normality into its molecular weight whereas in case of free fatty acids we are using this volume consumed against the fat into normality of koh into 28.05 so from the, where this 28.05 comes it comes acid value divided by 2 we divide this 56.1 by 2 so we get 28.03 now the viva questions so saponification is used to determine the total acid content both free as well as combined fatty acid whereas acid number only measures the free fatty acids and what is the drawbacks of having this acid number uh, so increase acid number can leads the formation of sludge or gummy products it can causes corrosion to the machines so i hope you find this video helpful If you find this video helpful please subscribe my channel give me a thumbs up thank you all thanks for watching